You know, I've, I've been interested in weather and climate pretty much my whole life. 25 years ago, I contacted the state climate office and asked them if they needed any weather observers in the North Shore Highlands, and they said they did. And so they got in contact with the Weather Service, and before long I had instruments, and I've been doing this since 1998. Well, historically, the way that we measure temperature was in this uh, instrument shelter, which is called a cotton region shelter. It's basically a louvered wooden box. And this was, I think, invented in the 1870s or 80s. And inside we have two thermometers. They're liquid and glass thermometers. Starting in the 1990s, the Weather Service started phasing out of the liquid and glass thermometers and going to this system here, which is actually a digital system, this is called uh, an MMTS unit, Maximum Minimum Temperature System. And inside here is a, uh, a sensor, and that is connected to a readout in my basement, and that records uh, hourly and daily temperatures for 35 days. So this is what we do now, and if, I, if I've had a couple of lightning strikes, strikes that have, where the ground current has blown out my unit, and I can use the uh, old mercury thermometer and alcohol thermometer as a backup. I do this because I have, a, well, I have an interest in citizen science and just a natural curiosity uh, about the natural environment. And weather and climate are a big part of that. The Slice from WDSE WRPT.